Talking about violence on Ram Navami, Bengal continues to remain tense after the clashes that took place on Ram Navami. One person was killed, several others were injured after a clash erupted between two communities in West Bengal's Dalkhola city during a Ram Navami procession on Thursday. The police somehow controlled the situation. However, one you died, one person died, and several people, including five to six policemen, were injured. In Howrah, which also reported violence that remains tense now. Massive security forces have been deployed. BJP and VHP have slammed Mamata Banerjee over these clashes. This is the Shippur area of Howrah where clashes erupted between two communities yesterday and right now a huge police force have been mobilized here uh, and they are picketing, they are uh, doing their duty. A huge police deployment are everywhere in the area and the remnants of the, uh, uh, of the chaos which happened yesterday are still there. I am uh, showing you uh, these are the area where vehicles have been torched, the vehicles have uh, been removed uh, uh, since night and uh, the remnants are still there. Uh, you can see uh, the area is still tense, but but the situation is much better from yesterday. Ramjan ki yatraon ke upar, Muharram ki yatraon par hamle karne ki hoti hai. Aisa keval Ram Naomi ke avsar par aur keval Muslim samaj ke kuch tattvon ke dwara kya hota hai? Yeh visleshan karne ka vishe hai. Jab kuch secularist neta अपने मुस्लिम वोट बैंक के कारण इनको भड़काते हैं तो इनको भड़कने का अवसर मिल जाता है ममता बनर्जी को क्या जरूरत थी यह कहने की कि मैं राम रामनवमी के जलूसों को नहीं रोकूंगी लेकिन अगर मुस्लिम समाज पर हमले हुए तो मैं उन सब को देख लूंगी क्या एक भी उदाहरण उनके पास है वो हमलावर समाज की रक्षा करना चाहती है और जो पीड़ित समाज है उसी को धमकी देना चाहती सूर्य अग्नि गेरिंग आस ऑल ऑफ दोज डिटेल सूर्य अग्नि नॉट सरप्राइजिंग दर ब्लेम गेम इज इन दिस इंटायर मैटर बट टॉक टू अस अबाउट द इन्वेस्टिगेशन एट द एंड ऑफ द डे वन पर्सन इज डाइड इन दिस माइंडफुल फ्लैश दू प्लेस But Sneha, firstly, a breaking news uh, on the developments of today. The DJ of West Bengal Police has called for a press conference at 2 p.m. today. He'll be speaking to the press and he will be coming out with a lot of facts of the investigation. However, what we have, uh, you know, confirmed since morning today is that 36 people have been arrested in Howrah itself. Uh, uh, thankfully, the violence has stopped uh, after the massive deployment uh, of uh, uh, you know, both the Howrah and the Kolkata police uh, in that particular zone in Shippur where we were uh, since last night. Uh, you know, uh, no casualties were reported over here in Howrah. Injury list is still not out. The police hasn't come out clean on how many people were, uh, you know, uh, injured in the clash that had happened. Now, uh, amidst all of this, as you rightly mentioned, Sneha, yes, there is a political blame game with the BJP and the Trinamool Congress and even the VHP, uh, you know, uh, blazing their guns at each other. However, what, uh, uh, you know, what needs to be understood is that amidst this particular blame game, the incident that had happened had, has already happened and uh, the questions are coming in on, you know, who is to be blamed for this entire incident whether there was uh, some kind of uh, uh, you know uh, whether there was some kind of some delay or whether uh, you know uh, more uh, you know forces should have been kept during the shobha jatra or not even these questions are being raised by uh, you know a lot of the political corridors over here it's from the opposition political corridors of of west bengal uh, amidst all of this uh, 36 people sneha they have been arrested and in a short while from now the bengal dg the Director General of Police will be uh, making his, uh, you know, press note and he'll come out clean on what exactly went wrong, what, hap what had happened and uh, if or not they have been able to identify the ones who created the ruckus or not. Back to you, Steve. Thanking you for the moment. Surya Agni getting us all of those details as far as the writing and the tensions in Bengal, particularly Howrah, is concerned.